hello everyone i hope you all are keeping fine so here i am back with the new video and today i shall be uh, teaching you maths uh, chapter one and exercise one okay in my last class i had explained you the various terms which is related to this chapter that is sets right so today i shall continue chapter one and uh, today let us try to solve uh, the exercise one okay so with this let us start our class so exercise one page number eight so dear students kindly uh, see page number eight exercise one page number eight so let's start with question number one so i will show you few question and rest uh, you can try at home okay so let's start with 1a now what does it say rewrite the following sets in roster form and set builder form so i hope you all remember what is roster form and what is set builder form right because in my last class i had already explained you what is roster form and what is set builder form so a uh, there is a set given a natural numbers which are more than 7 and less than 13 okay here you have to uh, write this in roster form as well as in set builder form okay so question number one a now let's start with roster form all numbers which are more than 7 and less than 13 okay natural numbers start with 1 right and we have to write all the natural number which are more than 7 but they are less than 13 okay so we will write like this okay more than 7 it means 8 9 10 11 12 and less than 13 so this is your roster form now come to the next set builder form so set a is equal to x such that x e see it is less than 7 right less uh, it is less than 7 right and this 7 okay here it is say that all natural number which are more than 7 and less than 13 sorry my mistake uh, more than 7 it means this x should be greater than 7 but it should be less than 13 am i clear it should be greater than 7 this x it should be greater than 7 but less than 13 so this is how we should write in set builder form i hope that this is clear to you okay let us try few more question from here okay so uh, let us try one more from this question b okay square of natural number which are less than seven so we have to consider those natural number the square of those natural number which is less than seven so one two three four five six seven right out of this square of one is one right square of two is four square of three is nine but nine is less than uh, sorry it is greater than 7 right what we are asked to find we are asked to find square of the natural number which is less than 7 so 1 and 2 right it means 1 and 4 so the roster form will be your b is equal to 1 4 now the same thing if i have to this is roster form okay do write in full form i'm just writing here in uh, short now set builder form will be your x such that okay one it is less than x square right got it but see so this x what is this x this x is a natural number here okay so here we are considering uh, 
x as a natural number what is the quotient that square of the natural number it means square of this number it should be less than 7 but it will be greater than 1 right so 1 then x is x is greater than 1 and less than 7 so this is how you have to write i hope that this is clear to you so let us try one more from this okay 1 c let me show you one more from the same question <clears throat> okay let us try e 1 e yes negative integers see what are the integers you know this right so uh, it is a, a combination of what the negative number and the positive number right minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 0 1 2 3 isn't it so negative integers but here it is said negative integers not only integers right so negative integers means it should be less than 0 we know that 0 is greater than all negative integers right so start with minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 so these are what negative integers so here you are asked to write negative integer okay a set of negative integer so e is equals to minus 3 minus 2 minus 1 so there can be many okay minus 4 minus 3 minus 2 you can write from anywhere okay minus 7 minus 6 minus 5 okay you can start from anywhere now this is your roster method now for the same if you have to write the builder method then it will be x such that x is it should be less than 0 if x is an integer okay if we are considering x an integer then it should be less than 0 or not because even if it is equal to 0 it is not an integer right so integer negative integer should be less than 0 correct and x is an it is an element of i that is integer why x is an element of integer right so we have to mention it so i hope that this question number one is clear to you so kindly note it down in your notebook and uh, try the rest of the question okay so you can try c and d okay and you have to send me after solving this okay c and d now let us try question number two it is said that rewrite the following pair of sets in the roster form and state whether they are equivalent sets or equal set so here a set has been given you have to write the set in roster form and you have to write that whether it is an equal set or equivalent set so i will show you one for each okay and I hope you remember what is equal set and what is equivalent set. So, I am not going to repeat it as I have already explained it to you, okay, the definition. So, let us try question number 2. Question number 2, 1. Okay. Letters in word sin. C. S, I, N, C, E. This is since and the other is signs okay now you have to write this word in roster form first and then you have to tell it whether it is a equal set or equivalent set so dear students i hope you all remember that when we write a sets okay i have mentioned one thing that the elements uh, could not be repeated okay so elements are written one or it is just one time not uh, again and again right it, it shouldn't be repeated so if i have to write this in roster method let's start with since okay as and one more thing we know that this should be written in small letters okay these are element element should be written in small letter s i n c e so here no letter has been repeated now for signs s c i e n now see why didn't i write 
C and E because it is already given here. C and E, right? So, the elements are not repeated, okay? It couldn't be repeated, okay? So, here you see that how many elements are there? Five elements, right? So, this is your equal set. Why? Because the letter also same. 1, S is there, I is there, N is there, C is there, E is there. Means exactly the same letter has been repeated or I should say the elements are same. Therefore, P and Q are equal sets. Correct? Okay. Now, next. Next, let us try question number C, 2C. Okay. So, it is said that natural number, the set of C, okay. C is what? It is a natural numbers. Okay. And D is your whole numbers. Okay. C, natural number means 1, 2, 3, Correct? And D is equal to 0, 1, 2. So, we can say that this is equivalent set. Why? Because they are not same. Okay? Because natural number, uh, 0 is not a natural number, right? It is a whole number. But the number of elements are same. Therefore, it is not an equal set, but it is an equivalent set. So, C and D are equivalent sets. So, I hope that you all could follow me. I know this is very new chapter to you. It will take time uh, to understand, right? So, just listen uh, carefully so that you will be able to understand it, okay? And uh, the definition that I have uh, explained it to you, do learn it, okay? All the terms. Otherwise, you will find very difficult to follow the problems, okay? To solve the problems. So, I hope this is clear now. So, rest, you try this, okay? You solve it and you send it to me. If you could not do, then I will definitely help you out. But you have to try this first. Okay. Then come to the question number three. Question number three is, rewrite the following sets in a roster form and determine the cardinal number of each set. Okay. Now you have to write this in a roster form. And you have to write its cardinal number. Means the number of element it has. Okay. So, let us do this question number 3. I hope you all have penned down this in your notebook. So, I shall rub this. Okay. Question number 3. So, question number 3B. Oh, my pen is not working. Okay. Okay. It is said that natural number less than 1. See, you are asked to write natural number less than 1. So, is there is any natural number which is less than 1? Is there is? No. Because the natural number starts from 1, isn't it? So, this will be your nil. Okay, it means null. So, the roster form will be your So, B is equal to this nil or you can write null. Okay, and cardinal number is also equal to nil because there is no cardinal number. Okay. Then come to question number E. 3E. So, it is said that x is square. Okay. Such that x is an element of n and x is smaller than 6. See, x is square. 
okay now we are asked to find the value of x square but the value of x okay it should be less than 6 so if we keep 1 then it will be your 1 square right i hope you can see x square it is said x square but x should be less than 6 it shouldn't be great uh, it shouldn't be more than 6 now less than 6 means what 1 2 3 4 5 right now we have to put this value here in x square so 1 square 2 square 3 square 4 square okay and 5 square so 1 4 9 16 25 correct so your answer will be e e is equal to 1 4 9 16 and 25 i hope that you have understood how this came okay so this is the answer 1 4 9 16 25 so this is your set of the number now cardinal number how many are elements are there one two three four five so cardinal number is five okay so there are five cardinal number okay let me just write here i hope then you will be able to see one four nine 16 25 and cardinal number is equal to 5 i hope this is clear to you okay okay let us try one more and i hope after that it will be more clear to you okay you'll be able to do the rest of the question okay so let us try g it is said that twice x okay okay twice x such that x is an element of whole number okay remember it is an element of whole number so whole number is from 0 1 2 3 right okay but the condition has been given and x is less than 5 okay so twice x but x should be greater than. Now, we have to find the value of this. Now, what will be this? Okay. Twice x means. Okay. x less than 5 means it will start from 1, 2, 3, 4. Right? Am I clear? Okay. Now, twice x means 2 into 1, 2 into 2, 2 into 3, 2 into 4. So, what we will get? 2, 4, 6, 8. Isn't it? So, what will be the set? Your set will be 2, 4, 6, 8. And what will be the cardinal number? Cardinal number is equal to 4. I hope that this is clear to you. I hope that you can follow this. Right, so this is your question number three. Okay, so kindly note it down in your uh, notebook. Okay, all right, question number four. Uh, it is said that state which of the following statements are true and which are false. Okay, I'll just read out, uh, note it down in your notebook or in your textbook. Okay. If A is equal to A, B, C and B is equal to c a b then a is equal to b okay here it is said that a set a is given set a is equals to a b c okay and set 
B is equal to C A B and then it is said that A is equal to B. Whether this statement is true or false, the statement is true, right? Because the elements are same. Therefore, set A is equal to set B. True. The answer is true. Second, the set of point on a line is a finite set. Is it? If there is a line drawn, okay, and it is said that the point on it are finite. Is it finite? Finite means fixed number. Is it that? No, you can uh, mark so many points on a straight line, isn't it? So, it is infinite. So, false. Second is the set of words used in your mathematics book is an infinite set. Okay, it is said that set of words in mathematics book is infinite set. So, this is your false, okay. Then, Rahul Dravid belongs to a set of bad cricket player. Is it? Is uh, Dravid, uh, Rahul Dravid was a bad player? What, uh, how he is considered as, in which group? He is in a, as a good player, right? He is known as a good player. So, he couldn't be in a set of bad players, bad cricket player. So, this is false, okay? The E, number E. The set of books that have been written by Prem Chand is a finite set. Is it? Prem Chand has uh, written so many books, right? But it is finite. True or false? True. Because the number is fixed, right? He might have written uh, 10 books or 15 books or 20 books. But the number are finite set. Isn't it? So, the answer is true. Okay. So, I hope that. Uh, this is uh, clear to you question number four up to question number four okay similarly the question number five you just have to state it whether the following statement is given the condition which is given are in set or not you have to say whether they are a set or they are not yes or no right okay all good books in a book stall Okay, all good books in a book stall is a set. Is it true? See, there, there, there are so many good books, isn't it? So, in a book stall, how, how will you group it? Isn't it? So, this is not a set. All odd numbers. Yes or no? Odd numbers is a group, right? It is a set like 1, 3, 5, isn't it? Uh, then uh, 7. So, we can group it. So, it is a set. All even numbers between 9 and 99. See, between 9 and 99, all the even number is a set. Right? We can make a group out of it. Like 2, okay. 9 and 10, uh, 99, right? So, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, right? So, uh, till 99, till 98, right? In between all the even number, we can make a group. So, this is a set. Yes. B is also yes. D, uh, C is also yes. Difficult problem in your mathematics book. So, can you make out a group out of it? That how many difficult problems is there in a maths book? No, it is not a set, right? So, this is not a set. D. Then, good players in cricket team of your school. See, good players in cricket team of your school. A cricket to player good players in a cricket team so you cannot make a group out of it right so it is not a set you cannot make a set all good movies Medina 2007 all the movies <laughs> that was released in 2007 okay we cannot make a group right so there is no set of good movies then all bad boys in your class no right we cannot make a set no one is bad right so, natural numbers between 1 and 1000. Yes, we can make a group. So, yes, H is a set. Then, integers between minus 9 and 9. Yes, we can make a set of integer which is between minus 9 and 9. Then, all movies in which Amitabh Bachchan acted. Yes, definitely. Because we know the numbers, right? We can make a set of a movie where or in which uh, Amitabh Bachchan has acted. Correct? So, yes, J is a set. 
ओके आई विल रिपीट क्वेश्चन नंबर फाइव सो बी सी एच आई एंड जे ओके दिस आर सेट आई होप दैट दिस इज क्लियर टू यू सो देर आर टू मोर क्वेश्चन लेफ्ट आउट विच आई विल कवर इन माई नेक्स्ट वीडियो okay till then you just note it down in your notebook okay so i'll see you in my next class